This is a taster video of what we're hoping will be a series of videos looking at high volume injection for hydro dissection for nerve entrapments around the medial ankle. And we're going to look at the uh, treatment of Baxter's nerve in this video. Um, so we've marked Peter up. We've put a little bit of skin prep on so it's kind of marking. We lost some of the markings. We've got edge of medial malleolus hair. We followed down artery and nerve, and then Peter's main problem is really Baxter's nerve plantar lateral pain. So this is really kind of the course of our first branch of our lateral plantar nerve. And there's a little bit of soreness in the, the distal tarsal tunnel as well. So okay. high volume guide Three, injection. Three, two, one, scratch. Hold on, sir. So our nerve stim currently set at five milliamps. So the first thing George is going to do is really locate some nerve tissue. We're looking for some twitching of the toes. That's a really track. So one of the things, Peter, is we'll get the toes, which is good, but I want to feel if you're actually getting some symptoms coming over that part of the heel across yeah, the Yeah, I, I was just, um, just, a just before before you moved, okay. before you moved it, I could just feel it. So if you get that, let me know, because we often will rely on the toes moving, but for this particular one, I want to just catch this one. Yeah, they're a little wee bit there. Okay. Yeah, and the toes going. We're getting lateral there. Yeah, you can yeah. Tell that very deep. That's good. Well, that's our guy. Absolutely. So I'm calling it five milliamps. So George is just. So Peter, what we're doing is we're taking that ampage down because if you put about five milliamps in, that's the that that voltage goes around a wee way. Okay. We want to be ha small voltage, which means we're right on the nerve, okay. so that it just means we're, we're super accurate. Okay. So we George is one of his three hands. He's just turning down the gain on our nerve stim down to about 0.5, maybe 0.75. We're so that we know we're right on the nerve, but still but, getting uh, just the merest little flicker in the toes. Mm -hmm. So the nurse team is to tell you where it is. We're still going to be a bit there at 0.6. I'm just going to come down a little bit so we lose it. So we aspirate I want to lose at that point. and inject a little, little bit, bit of pressure. Pressure. Ooh. And then sometimes you'll feel that going in, Peter. You can kind of you get yeah. you, you almost reproduce those symptoms. Yeah, I can feel a little bit of pain across the bottom of the heel as well as you're doing that. Right. On that which, which, is a, which, which is a good sign. Excellent. Okay. So that's the one that's actually getting that nerve as yeah. it comes down, properly comes down. But now we'll go into where you've got the scarring. You're not going to get the same sort of twitching and things. You may get it a little bit if we're on it, but I just want to be near it to break up some of the scar yeah. tissue on this bottom bit. Yeah. So I'm going to come right to the bottom, a little bit scratchier now. Scratchy yeah. now. So mainly I want you to tell me now if you're getting that sort of bit of a nerve discomfort yeah. in that area. Oh, we're getting it. See the little toes twitching again there, yeah, viewers. I'm not really feeling much. Really. No, that's fine. I'm probably just at the base of the muscle. So I'm some of that because the low anesthetic has just settled down some of the feeling. Okay. Yeah, there's mm -hmm. quite, quite a bit going there, isn't it? There is. We should just what you want. Well, jo really George and I were just saying that, that lots of guys do this sort of thing with ultrasound. Which is great yeah. if you've got a really high res image, you can kind of say, well, you yeah. can sort of see the nerve. Yeah. But with this, you know, you're on it. So we, we, um, we're looking to promote this as a technique. So, so the, mus the particular nerve that we're looking at does supply that toe, which makes it do that. Yeah. Equally, the muscle for that toe runs right down there here. So if you're touching the muscle, it will make it flick a little. Okay. Um, but equally, because you've had local anaesthetic on that nerve now, you might not get the same yeah, sort of painful radiation as, um, that you get. It's not as uncomfortable as when you were. So I'm just going to move it and just point. see if we can get some. But if not, it's not too concerning because I'm right on it there. George, just before you aspirate and inject, can you just put the syringe just in shot so people see what you can do with your left hand before we go? Yeah. So I know you're not there yet because you're still at five. In fact, I want to turn down the game with my third hand. No, 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 okay. no I'm good for now, yeah, I just want to... If we get it a little bit uncomfortable there, there. Having said that, if you've had cryo here, it's probably a patch of numbness. Mm. In from the side there, not not. From the they went in from the middle side, Peter, or from the from the outside? From, from the side. From where we had the first one. Just back, probably from where you um, went in first time.
Okay, so we aspirate. Let me inject, we hold it where we are, you'll get a little bit of back pressure, so it wants mm -hmm. me a bit of pressure again. Yeah, feel it. Great. There's no pain there. There we go. The injectate itself is a mixture of local anaesthetic and sterile saline. And we favour Narapin because it's a nice long acting and one of the, the safe of the local anaesthetics in combination with some steroid um, we favour Depomedrone for soft tissues. The idea to do a hydrodissection or a hydrodilation to stretch the tissues away. This particular patient had had Baxter's nerve irritation for some time, had had cryotherapy at St Elsewhere and had fairly limited improvement from the cryotherapy so there's a degree of scar tissue. So the technique was to try and stretch the tissues away and hydrodilatation, hydrodissection is used in lots of other areas of medicines using plastic surgery, bowel shirt surgery, carpal tunnels, um, particularly in terms of other nerve entrapments. And um, we're currently writing up and researching our use in tarsal tunnel and Baxter's and medial calcar nerve entrapments. So look out for some further work and hopefully some publications coming on the stream. Thank you for listening as always. Thank <laughs> you.